we will discuss about the orbit uh, this is the right side of the orbit we have dissected this is the left side of the orbit and this is a cribriform plate uh, crista galli and cribriform plate here we have removed the medial side of the plate and first of all we have removed the orbital fascia and just after the orbital fascia we can see there is a one now on the first upper one it is a frontal now it is a branch of the ophthalmic division of the trigeminal now so this is the uh, frontal now and this frontal now on the divide into the two branches supratrochlear and supra orbital medial one it is a supratrochlear and lateral one is the supra orbital and both are supplies to the forehead sensory now supplies to the forehead other branch of the the uh, ophthalmic division it is a lacrimal now on the lateral aspect which supplies to the lacrimal gland and here you can see this is a lacrimal now and along with it there is a lacrimal artery it is just uh, about to the lateral rectus always it is lies about to the upper border of the lateral rectus it is a lacrimal vessels and nerves third now uh, you have to see the branch of the ophthalmic division this is a frontal now after cut it you can see there is a muscle it is a first mu muscle it is a levator palpebral superioris after that you can see this other muscle it is a superior rectus and medial side over that here you can see inside there is a muscle it is a medial rectus muscles and this is a superior oblique so the levator palpebral superioris Uh, superior rectus and uh, medial rectus which is supplied by the uh, upper division of the oculomotor now this is a, a third cranial now it is a oculomotor now and this oculomotor now which is divides into the upper and lower division upper division which supplies to the uh, three muscles levator palpebral levator palpebral superioris uh, superior rectus and medial rectus muscles uh, here we have got this uh, all this structure uh, sup li levator palpebral superior superior rectus and after that you can see there is a nerve which crosses from lateral to medial side it is a nasociliary nerve here you can see this is a nasociliary nerve and again this nasociliary it divide anteriorly into the uh, anteriorethmoidal and posteriorethmoidal and this nasociliary also gives the short ciliary and long ciliary branches Uh, this thread like branches are the long and short ciliary branches and this is the lateral rectus and this lateral rectus which is supplied by uh, the uh, six now it is a abducens now this is a abducens now which is coming uh, from the this is the abducens now below to the fourth now and third now and about to the trigeminal now this is the trigeminal ganglion and this trigeminal it is a, a mandibular division this is a maxillary division and this is a ophthalmic division of the trigeminal now this is the just behind to the trigeminal ganglion you can see there is a carotid siphon which is form and this carotid siphon which is the this is a cut end of the carotid end and it makes the circle of release this is the optic now and here you can see there is a uh, this is a superior oblique muscles and inside the superior oblique this now which is goes inside it is a trochlear now the other portion of the trochlear now which is already cut here and this is a superior oblique which makes the trochlea and this trochlea which is uh, inserted on the sclera on the late uh, medial aspect and this Uh, contraction of the superior oblique it lead to there is a intrusion of the uh, eyeball and the inferior oblique which is lies below to the uh, lateral rectus and uh, here the inferior rectus and uh, inferior oblique both are on the lower aspect we have not dissected but it is supplied by the inferior division of oculomotor nerves so and here also along with this uh, nasociliary nerve you can see there is a artery it is a ophthalmic artery and this ophthalmic artery it gives the uh, many branches it is gives the central branches of the retina it gives the lacrimal branches 
it gives the anti ethmoidal post ethmoidal and other branches uh, nasociliary artery short ciliary long ciliary all this artery arterial branch of the ophthalmic artery hope you enjoy the lecture thank you very much